Hey y'all, it's D. Welcome back. We in our favorite spot, Dollar General. I'm gonna show you how to save big, at least 50% or more using all digital coupons today only because we have this five off of 25 coupon that is valid on Saturdays. So y'all let me know in the comments where y'all are from, what the weather's like. I'm here in Georgia, not too bad, but I am one that's always cold, which is why I got this hoodie on. But don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and let me show you how to save so you never have to pay full price moving forward. All right, y'all, we got an amazing deal on our drinks. And if you like Dr. Pepper, then this is gonna be your week so what we're gonna do is pick up three of the Pepsi 12 packs and you can do this deal without getting the Mountain Dew but you're gonna come out cheaper getting the Mountain Dew so I'm gonna make sure at least two of them are Mountain Dew now we have a two dollar digital that works for like certain Mountain Dews like the ones that kind of look like this and then we have a separate two off of three digital that works for like the Pepsi products so again just depending on how you want to do it you could clip either one but regardless we're going to get two dollars off with that but make sure two of your drinks are the Mountain Dew. All right y'all and you know we got to get our chip item so we can use that three dollar digital for when we buy the Pepsi and the Frito-Lay. That is a store coupon, so we should be able to stack that with the $2 digital, um, which is a manufacturer coupon. So I like to grab the, these munchies at three forty-five because those are the cheapest that attach to that coupon. But again, y'all, like I always say, the goal is not to pay full price. You could pay a little bit more and maybe get some of the regular Lay's chips or maybe you want one of the dips. So again, cater it to your need. Wow, y'all might have to go to another store. I wanted to pick up the big box of the Frito-Lay chips, the 28 pack. So I'm probably going to go to another store, y'all, because I definitely wanted to grab that. But since I'm at this store, I'm going to go ahead and grab one of the Mountain Dews that are $9.50. It's going to be the ones right here. So the 18 count. And we have a separate $2 digital. So let's grab this, get this added. And if your store happens to be out of like Mountain Dew in the regular section, make sure you check different owls. And then these are actually found in like the front of the store. If maybe they're not in the normal section. And then y'all, we have this four off of 14 digital coupon for Mountain Dew only. So with our Mountain Dew products, we should be over that threshold since this is $9.50 alone. And with these being three for 13, that roughly comes out to about like $4 and some change each. So we should be good to go for that four off of 14 store coupon to come off. And because that $3 store coupon does attach to the Mountain Dews as well, what I'm hoping will happen is if we at least have the munchies rung up first and let's say the Pepsi product rung up first, hopefully that $3 digital still comes off. So this is definitely going to be one of those deals. If you have a higher out of pocket, it might be because like the $3 digital didn't come off. But if my math is math and it should still work out. So this is how your cart should look. And everything in our cart should total us $25.95. But remember, don't forget to clip that five off of 25 coupon. And when that comes off and all our other coupons at the register, we should pay just nine dollars and 95 cents making each item y'all a dollar 99 each and again y'all when you're doing this deal if you are doing it kind of like me where you're making one of the drinks just a regular pepsi 12 pack then have that rung up first in the chips so that way that three dollar digital hopefully attaches to that and then have the mountain dew products rung up last so that way that four for 14 coupon can uh come off because that might give us issues um and i'm thinking too what i might even do um, or what you could even do is just act like you're checking out as normal, but have the cashier click like total after they ring up those two if you feel comfortable and then add the other items and see if it works out that way as well. So if you made it this far, comment down below Pepsi, Mountain Dew, or Cheese Fix. And don't forget to like and follow for more ways to say. All right, y'all made my way to another store and we are off to a good sign. So they have the chips, so we're gonna go ahead and grab these Frito-Lays right here. This is the 28 count for $14.80. And then we have that, ooh, that $2 digital. Um, and I plan on also stacking that with that $3 store digital we have. So y'all know I gotta get the drink. All right, I'm over here trying to find the tea. I'm like, where is it? I'm at a store I'm not used to going to, but I'm gonna go ahead and grab one of those lifting teas. Y'all know I like to grab those for $2.50. Um, but you could also, like I always say, you could grab like the two liter Pepsi drinks if maybe you prefer those instead at like $2.75. Or you could grab the regular Lipton teas. They're actually two for five if maybe you wanna grab one at $3.50 or two for five. And if y'all been following me, y'all know I had posted about this little 
deal we had going on on the Caesar dog food and I think it's still working. So I'm going to try to test it out. Hopefully this store has them in stock. Oh, wow. But you can get the ones at like 150 or 135. So it's these little Caesar wet dog foods and you want to pick up four. They're also on an instant savings where when we buy three, we're going to save a dollar instantly. But for some reason, when we're picking up five, this there are four off of five digital is coming off. And then it looks like we're getting like some extra discount somewhere. Because when I end up picking up five, y'all, it ended up being like free and gave me a little bit of overage. So because we got some instant savings, y'all know those come off first. So we need to make sure we're probably at at least 27, I'm assuming. But I'm definitely going to try to test this out. So let me try to find some of the ones at 135 and get those added. But these are definitely going to be some great filler items. Y'all, and why when I'm scanning this one, it's coming up 75 cents. And the instant saving isn't attaching, but that four for five is. A part of me, I don't know. I'm trying to think if I should add this or not. And they have a whole bunch, y'all. Because if I picked up four of these, y'all or five of these that'll bring me to like 375 so that'll give me like 25 cents in overage so decisions decisions because i could come out just factoring this in instead but i feel like i have a higher out of pocket um or uh, i have more going towards my threshold so i'm trying to debate how i'm going to do this but i might just do it like this that way i don't have to worry about the instant savings and how much i need to add to make sure that in when the instant savings comes off i'm still at 25 so we gonna see y'all so if you made it this far comment down below make up your mind or dog food and don't forget to like and of course subscribe if you haven't already all right y'all and then as a filler item i'm gonna go ahead and pick up these um crest toothpaste right here at three dollars we have a two dollar digital and a dollar digital so only clip the two dollar one if you're only picking up one and remember y'all to check out my full best deals video because i'm in here doing my personal haul but remember we have some instant savings going on with like the colgates and the palm olives and things of that sort uh, fabuloso suave tail but when you spend 15 you save five dollars instantly so just make sure if you're doing that deal your total is at least at 30 so that way with the instant savings comes off you can still um, get that five for 25 to come off because this would be a great filler item as well like I mentioned last week the Colgate toothpaste the kids one they're 350 each we have a five off of two digital but at least that's seven dollars helping you reach that fifteen dollar threshold to save five dollars instantly you could even add in some of the toothbrushes for like seven dollars we got like four dollar digitals or some of the toothpaste so several ways to get to that fifteen dollar mark and again you don't just have to get Colgate it works for several other items and y'all got a little excited for a second because I noticed that these Charmin uh, essentials they have them at this store and earlier in the week y'all that three off of two PG coupon we have was attaching to these these are like 215 and we have that three dollars and 30 cents off when you buy like the Charmin and Febreze or mix and match but I scanned it it's not attaching that would have been a great filler item now I did scan these which are like 350 and that coupon is attaching so you could maybe grab this if your store has this and you maybe you do want to grab the tissue but i'm gonna put that right on back all right y'all so here's how i'm thinking i'm probably going to do the deal um i'm again not quite sure because we're getting that additional discount if that's going to be considered like an instant savings so i just made sure i'm at least at 27 so we're gonna see y'all so i ended up getting the ones at 135 um i might try to see if i can do a deal with this but i'm not sure just yet but this brings us to 2705 and then when our file for 25 comes off and all our other coupons at the register will pay so i'm thinking when everything comes off we're gonna say we're gonna get that four dollar digital plus two dollars from instant savings we're gonna see if that's how it works out but i should end up paying y'all 905 making each item just a dollar 13 each now if it doesn't work out i might just take away this and add in this but I'm still going to need something for about a dollar. So let me see how it would be if I just switched it around like this instead. But again, I would need to add in something for like a dollar. So if I did it like this instead and then adding something in for a dollar, that would bring me to, that'll bring me to 2505. And then when all my digitals come off y'all at the register, I'm going to pay just $9 in like five cents. So actually y'all, I might do it like this. We're going to see. So I think I'm going to try it like this first because I think I might have a cheaper out of pocket. And then if it doesn't work out, I'm probably just actually, no, I know I keep going back and forth. But because I forgot I'm getting something for a dollar in addition to this, I might just do it like this. Uh, but again, you might can't find these because remember, these are on clearance for 75 cents. So 
just be careful with y'all right, i thought about it i think i'm just gonna keep it the regular way because it actually still comes out the same and i'm getting an additional item so it makes more sense for me to do it like this and then i don't have to worry about those the instant savings since it's not attaching to the caesar right here this uh clearance one all right, y'all went ahead and checked out. Let me show you the receipt. Now, when I got to the register and I checked out, my out of pocket was like $13.05 before tax. So that let me know my $4 digital didn't come off for the Caesar. So what I ended up doing was telling her to add two more. And when she did that, um, then it kind of worked out. So I don't know if maybe I could have just added one. So let me show y'all. So here's the receipt for the most part. Everything worked out beautifully. So I ended up getting an additional two, but paying 50 cents more, if that makes sense. So I'm wondering if the instant savings still came off. But regardless now, y'all, that means I got a total of, that ends up making all 10 items, y'all, just 95 cents each. So again, this instant savings, I'm not sure quite how it's working out. So I probably would pick up five of the ones at 135 and see how your total is. And if it's $4 more, then I would just add one as needed. But again, remember I have five of the ones at 75 and then I added an additional two. So yeah. And y'all, it just hit me. I never added in the item for a dollar that I needed to put me at the $25 mark. So that's why my out of pocket was $4 more. Because if I would have added the dollar item in, then my five off of 25 would have came off and I would have been good to go. But I'm still glad with what I did because I just added in two more of the 75 cent dog foods. That's something I would have used or, or my dog would have used anyway. So I did just want to make that little note. So if you made it this far, y'all, comment down below. Never pay full price or Frito-Lay. Or just comment down below the number 28. And don't forget to like and follow for more ways to save. And remember, if you are one that's struggling with your deals going as planned, make sure y'all grab my free copy, your free copy of my coupon trip checklist at heyomd.com. Or you can always just click the link in the bio of this video. So I'll see y'all next time. Bye-bye.